what's up y'all it's Maisha here and um I am making a video about absolutely nothing today I am trying to get into the swing of um creating content and um I just said I'm just gonna start and so I don't necessarily have a topic <laughs> um or anything so while I do my makeup to get ready for church I just said I'm going to start I don't know how it's gonna be but hey what's wrong with starting okay but anyway so I am doing my makeup because I am here in San Antonio Texas um, for a worship conference I'm a worship leader as well <laughs> as a hairstylist and um, I have a cosmetic line and that that good stuff. So anyway, I'm here in San Antonio and um, I am about to go to church in a, in a little bit. <laughs> and um, yeah, hold on. Oh. Uh, can y'all talk while y'all do your eyebrows? Because it be hard. I have to concentrate. Like, <laughs> I got to concentrate. <laughs> Honey. So, yeah, I um <laughs> went ahead and carved out my eyebrows but yeah so anyway absolutely nothing i just wanted to come on and talk and create and get this thing going y'all so i am a new business owner well not new but new to what i'm doing now um i actually saw a little bit about myself i am a hairstylist of 23 years and i've, I've been doing hair for a long time um I love doing hair and um but I ventured about a year ago into something different which is cosmetics. I started off by selling eyelashes and um I really love, you know, the the um what what am I what am I trying to say? I love the response I got from people um you know selling eyelashes and so then um I kind of wanted to, I've, I've actually thought about it um, for a few years, kind of on and off about selling lipstick. And so um, um, I was like, oh, maybe I can do it, you know, sell lipstick or blah, blah, blah. Um, so actually when I actually did it, actually, I say actually like five times. But anyway, when I decided to do it, um, like actually do it, it was during the pandemic. Um and I wanted to create a product that I knew everything that was in it. And so I opted to do lip gloss because I realized that I could make my own and I knew the ingredients that were that were in it. And um, it was fun to make, it was therapeutic. I mean, you know, all that good stuff. And so um, I began making lip gloss and that's how I started my lip line. And so um, I did okay upon starting. I learned a lot um, within the first year. Um, I learned a lot <laughs> what to do, what not to do. I learned different branding uh, ideas and packaging. And even though I kind of researched the stuff before, like it's nothing like putting your hands in it and actually, you know, doing it. You know what I mean? Because experience is an amazing teacher so um that's what i did i um i started and i learned a lot so my packaging got better my formulas got better um my tubes got better like y'all i was using upon starting i was using like the avery labels for my for my um labels for my tube for my squeeze tube and for my my um wand tubes and um it i mean it was okay <laughs> but it wasn't you know 
it was it was okay for starting i'll just say that now you know i have these tools with the logo that's already on it um you know it looks so much better than i have boxes you know so yeah but anyway so i did that and so now a year and a month later i am expanding to um cos other cosmetics um lip gloss lip liners um i'm sorry i said lip gloss lipstick liquid lipstick um which is this lip liners um eyeshadow palette this is one of my lipsticks it's a matte it's a liquid matte it's really pretty but anyway um what i say because i forgot lip liner okay lipstick <laughs> lip liner eyeshadow palette um mascara makeup brushes and makeup bags um I think that's it and of course i still have the the lip gloss and the the eye eyelashes yeah so anyway um when i tell y'all this has been a stressful process like i love it because i love first of all i love cosmetics and i love makeup and all that good stuff um but it's not easy it's not for the for the faint <laughs> it's not for the weak um being an entrepreneur and um selling product and getting your your name on stuff and getting your logo on stuff you know so yeah but you know like i said it's fun i love it i love what i do and so that's why i do it um my goal is to like probably what everybody else who does cosmetics my goal is to sell in stores and um i know i you know i've been told that in order to sell in some of these stores um you have to be like at a certain you know amount of clientele or what have you so anyway that's my that's my goal like i'm i want to i want to go big you know because what's the purpose if you're not going big what's the point so yeah, I um that's what I do. But y'all, when I tell y'all like the money it costs to to um you know to purchase branding like to uh where is my brush? To um to uh, I'm so sorry, y'all. I just, my my brain, I'm looking for makeup and I'm looking at the time because like I told y'all, I'm getting ready for church and your girl going to be late, late. But anyway, um, branding, logos, packaging, um, products, um, shipping costs, <laughs> internet, website costs. Like if you want to do it right, um, it's, it's going to cost. And I'm a pretty detailed person. Um, that's part of my personality. Um, so I have to have everything, you know, has to be right, you know, for me. Um, and that looks different for everybody. My right may not be another person's right and vice versa. But, you know. So, yeah, I, um, I'm, I'm putting a lot of money into it. Because I want it to be great. I'm putting a lot of money into this product. Into these products. Because I just want it to be great. I also have body butters too. So that's pretty good. It's pretty fun to make as well. And then I get amazing responses on those. Y'all people be like. <laughs> uh, you got some more of that body butter? <laughs> so yeah. But yeah. I um, I enjoy it. But baby maybe um i can do another detail kind of going in depth when i get back home i'm actually from um dfw and so um when i get back home from san antonio i can uh, make some more videos and i know this lighting isn't the best um but i'm gonna pop out in a minute and show y'all what i got going on with this um yeah so I just wanted to come on and talk a little bit. Um, I know so many entrepreneurs out there can relate 
Um, I'm still learning. I'm still trying to figure it out. Um, but I've come so far um, from where I was. So I'm super proud of myself, you know. And so, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm anticipating doing my launch, my relaunch, uh, the beginning of November, which is about a month and some days away. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to make that date, but I'm going to try. Um, oh, yeah. And so, oh, yeah. So I have a photo shoot with models. That's expensive. <laughs> I have to hire two makeup artists. That's expensive. Like for all my models, because I have about seven or eight models um, for my branding shoot. And so, yeah. <laughs> Like I said, though, I'm not going to complain. Wouldn't trade it for the world, y'all. But, yeah, I just wanted to come on and chit-chat, you know, talk about entrepreneurship while I do this. I'm going to do my makeup, and I will be right back to show y'all the finished result. Not that this is a tutorial or anything, but I just want y'all to see. I'm not going to be looking, looking busted like this. You know what I'm saying? But, anyway, I'll be back, y'all. So here I am with my finished look. I actually like my hair today. It, it did okay. I think it's given. Is it given? I think it's given. But anyway, let me get dressed. Thank y'all for watching my video. I really appreciate it. I will definitely be back with more videos and everything that I've learned and to share with everybody. Bye, y'all.